Oh shit. I'm getting closer here. Hurry. We must go to where the game is being held. The participants must find a unicorn's horn, a golden fish, and a phoenix egg. With these in hand, they can deduce where the hare, Milton, hides. I mean we need to find those things too. We've no other option, but time is of the essence, so we shall have to break the rules. Best cure for the beast, a witch hunt. Second boat through here. I shall show you where the hunt plays out. Then we will split up. You will get hold of the unicorn horn and the golden fish. While I nab the phoenix egg. That will be quickest. The unicorn. How do I catch it? It's terribly skittish, true, but I'm sure you will find a way to earn its trust. It runs around over there. Look. Golden fish. What the hell? Do I need a rod or a net? Please, Geralt. It's not a real fish. Look there, towards the water. See the lights? The hunters are trying to hook the fish from boats. You must simply dive in and find it. The Colton fish and the horn both contain things or clues that will help us find Milton. Once you have fish and horn, find me among the other Phoenix egg hunters. All clear? Then let's get to it. Alright, salvete spectators, it's Master Post. Welcome back to the Wild Hunt. Blood and Wine expansion. And it is indeed a Wild Hunt, for we have to prevent the murder of dear... what was it called? Malcolm? No. Maurice? Something with M, I suppose. So let's get to the unicorn. I think Axie is our friend. Or thought to what? Perhaps an apple will work. Or some sweets. We would not be in this predicament, dear sister. Were you still a virgin? Do you really wish <coughs> to have this conversation yeah. again? Here and now? Hush, or you'll spook the beast. We shall try the sweets. Hey, folks. Gonna have to ruin your fun. Sorry. Who's that? Oh my. So we will have to hunt it. Come on, stay calm. Shh. Ah, oh, that bird. Easy now. Well, that's hardly fair. Flagrant cheating is what it is! Sirs, we must teach this scamp some proper sportsmanship. Hands off, a man's life is at stake. A bold-faced lie! Let's show the scoundrel the true meaning of valor. Let's dance. Are you kidding me? Holy shit. I don't think I stand a chance here. Honestly. We 
shall teach you manners. No. He's a cheat, a cat. We shall teach you manners. Ah, that was nice. I think heavy blows are better. Life's getting low. You shall regret your dishonesty, He's a cheat, a cat. Get down, suckers. No, no, no. Shit. I hope you've learnt your lesson. If Come on. They're available for more tutoring. Fuck a doodle do. No rematch. Yeah, that's Don't right. Time. I'm in a hurry. Gardens are huge. Be better off on horseback. Unworthy. Entirely inappropriate behavior. A complete collapse of social. Yeah, I don't care. I got whacked by some puny. What was it? Nobleman. Where was the goldfish? Down here. No need for horses. Behold the hell's going on here? Erecalia, a predator wild, bloodthirsty and ferocious. Beauty and oh. grace embodied in murderous form. Yeah, I got no time for a ferocious leopard. We have to rescue. It's bad that it's night time. I, I don't see as well. What the hell? Okay. Toffee, candy, candy. Huh. I don't see. Oh, I must have spotted it. Hey, wait. Stop. It's important. Are you kidding me? King Cormorant Sire, accept this offering we bring. Prithee, cast upon us your merciful eye and bear before us its secrets. As the moon is heavenly course doth trace, in my domain I await that moment of grace when a soul of good or ill repute brings me a gift, fitting tribute. <laughs> a key. Why, you bombard stretch! Ruins the game. Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, we we definitely he have to read the other hint. So, key from the golden fish here, and it has to be some note. Clue from the horn of a unicorn. End like a mouse with the head of hard cheese. What? Uh, okay. I don't know what that means. Where are we? This is an outrage. Yeah, yeah. Let's get back to the mainland. Bad thing is that it's night time now. So, the murderer would have an easier time. I wonder if we will be able to rescue our our knight errant comrade or if it's scripted the way that we find no, no, only his corpse. Show myself in. Hmm. So where do we have to go? Meet the Duchess. Milton, Milton was his name, I knew it. Okay, get back up there. Where's the unicorn? Did 
Did somebody just scream help? Huh. I don't have time, I don't have time. Are we on the right path? Oh shit, no. It's back and then left. I'm very sorry that I ruined the game for all these people, but... A knight errant's life is at stake. If you please, your grace. We do not please. We act out of the highest necessity. All shall be explained later. But it's against the rules. I am the rules. L'état c'est moi. Geralt, at last. Got a key and a clue. And I've another. Show me yours. Who wrote this drivel? I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease, then end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. What? Let let's let's think about it. I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease. Some place cramped. An end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. Pantry, greenhouse. A head of hard cheese. In a cave? I have I I have no Rice idea. And cheese. Palace pantry maybe? No. The hare is obliged to hide here in the gardens. Look, if we take row, hollow it out and fill it with ease. The letters, that is. We get green. Then mouse, ah. but starting with what heads heart cheese. Why, it's greenhouse. <laughs> Pretty clever, and it sounds right to me. There are several greenhouses in the gardens, but only one with a door that locks, and the key to it looks just like the one we found. Greenhouse it is then. Let's go. Well, the Duchess is more intelligent than I am. Could be dangerous, m'lady. Oh, what the butch? What was that? What was that? This is no ordering, man. Is this a vampire? to you maybe it did but you may keep it I've a new one I do not know you I've done you no harm yet first you butchered a Bruxer who was dear to me now you pursue me why you've killed four innocent people at least and you how many innocents have you cut down plenty even more of the guilty, though. You're next. Hmm. I think not. You see, I've something to do still. More murders? Just one. Oh. Not counting yours. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 
What? You are to stay where you are. Regenerate. I know you're in trouble. I can help. I'll help myself! No, he's my friend. Yes, Geralt, it's me. Regis? Wait. You all right? All is well. All's in order. Wounds such as these heal on vampires in moments. But we've not seen one another in ages, my friend. At least in human terms, that is. How's this even possible? Last I saw you... I was a bubbling, shapeless smear, having been rather spectacularly melted into a column of a certain castle. In somewhat better shape now, as you can see. Hardly peak for, mind you, but were I human, folk would think me a demigod, I dare say. I'm sorry. What happened? It was my fault. Never got a chance to apologize. No need, Geralt. Bygones. I did not have to join you on that expedition. No one twisted my arm. So we're talking about Regis. Regis, he's a vampire that is not hostile, that likes humans. He was a big side character in the in the books and in the final battle where Geralt and his crew came to rescue Ciri he fought against Vilgefortz, a mage and Vilgefortz just blew him to pieces with a powerful some kind of magic blast but apparently he didn't die because maybe vampires are immortal something like that and Regis here stopped the other vampire from killing me. Interesting. I wonder if 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 I have to lose in order to trigger this scene. Miraculous regeneration. How do you manage it? I had help from the one you hunt. Him? How? And what have you been doing all these years? Not the time nor place for such stories. I suspect we'll get a chance to speak at ease and at length later. Now. However, we must deal with the reason that brought us both here. <laughs> Local serial killer seems to obey you. Maybe you could talk him out of it, convince him to stop murdering. Why do you think I'd come? It shall not be easy, as Detlaf can be rather stubborn. Though you must certainly recall that neither do I surrender readily. So that's his name. He's your friend? You might call it that. Though Detlaf is, how would you humans put it, more bestial than I am. But not to worry, I'm working on him. Haven't exactly done a great job with that. He's killed one night since I got here, at least three others before I arrived. For good reason, I'm sure. Understand, Detlaf is not some decadent shit who kills for sport, or to assuage a dryness of throat or a dullness of mood. Hmm. So we were not able to rescue M Milton. And there needs to be a fifth murder for the fifth virtue. I wonder if we can stop him there. So in your opinion, what are his reasons? Precisely what I wish to find out. And then I will convince him of the error of his ways. Got a lot of faith in the guy. Despite appearances to the contrary, you two are quite alike. You've both noble hearts, yet you both are wont to perform ignoble deeds. When circumstances force you to, of course. Remember the year 964? <laughs> that was three centuries ago. Blind fear gripped Rivia, Lyria and Spala. Women and children were dying. Their mutilated, dismembered corpses littered the fields. Brute of Lyria. Read about it. Chewed up almost 200, then fell to a common poacher supposedly armed with a dagger blessed by some prophet. It fell to Detlaf, 
who then found a poacher asleep in the brush near his snares and dropped the fiend's corpse at his feet. And thus, a legend was born. Huh. Vampires rarely help humans. Must have had his own agenda hunting the beast. You err. He slew it for one reason alone. The monster killed a lad who once in the street had offered Detlaf an apple, expecting nothing in return. Terribly noble of him. You do not have a monopoly on altruism, my friend. Vilgefort melted my body. <laughs> Detlaf found what was left. As per our codex, he had a choice. To leave me where I was, or to care for me and nurture my remains. He chose the latter. Regenerated me at no small expense in his own blood. Do you know what that means to a vampire? The gravity of the endeavor? Probably same thing it means to a human. You owe him your life. Much more than that. The act itself made us blood brethren. A bond so strong humans cannot even imagine. Which is why I know something ill is afoot. Always had an overdeveloped sense of empathy. Each vampire has a unique talent. One they hone over centuries. It's precisely what renders us so difficult to classify. Detlaf's trump card is his herd instinct. His tribal propensity. In point of fact, he prefers the company of lesser vampires and shuns that of humans. If he walks among you, killing egregiously, it can only mean something's upset him immensely. Interesting. Anything specific? Huh. Some set of things that'd be likely to set him off? How should I say this? Detlaf doesn't understand men, their world, its rules, its conventions. He's naive in a sense. He doesn't comprehend your games, knows not what it means to lie, deceive. <laughs> suggesting he's maladjusted, inventing his rage. I'm suggesting maladjustment can at times breed conflict. But is it the case this time? I cannot say, but intend to find out. Gotta find him before something upsets him even more, and all Beauclair is awash with blood. Well, we share a cause then, just like the old days. Not entirely. I mean, when I find him, you know. I know you've a contract on his head. Yet your true task is to stop the beast killing, not necessarily to kill the beast, am I right? All in all, sure. Let us find him. By the time we do, I hope I'll have convinced you Detlaf is no monster. Fine, all right already. But for now, evidence is stacking up against him. Hear that? The posse. Knights must have tracked me here. I prefer they not find me here. I'd make shift quarters at Mela Chaise Long Cemetery. We'll meet there. See you. Okay. Witcher, we flew here as fast as our courses would carry us. Yet I fear we're late all the same. Pray, where is the beast? Still investigating. About to inspect this site. Withdraw your men before they trample all over the evidence. Ahem, <clears throat> sirs. We must let the Witcher do his work. Milton's murder cannot go unoffensed. Oh wow. So, I didn't die actually. I think it gets triggered when I am low on health. Maybe there's another cutscene when I actually defeat him because he has not... Uh, he's not invincible, by no means. Oh shit, I, I didn't want to throw a bomb. Just a torch. So, let's, let's have an investigation. Maybe there's anything? Not, not here. So the Bruxa was definitely... Purchasing brief. The Bruxa was definitely... Huh, okay. Only some accounts by a bookkeeper, maybe. The Bruxa was definitely a friend. And... In some way connected to this Deathlove vampire. Because 
she had his hands and he's got new ones, something like that. Let's check the upper floor. Here's an... Huh! Guardsman trousers, okay, we can sell that definitely. A love letter. Let's check this out. My beloved Clara, you have no idea how happy I am that the warehouse has been closed. How good is it? It is to know each time we wish to embrace, no one shall stand in our way. Neither my father nor your mother. It shall never occur to them we are rendezvous in this shattered warehouse. Blah blah blah. Longingly your Albert. Huh, interesting. <laughs> Maybe they got killed, I hope not, but we cannot know. Can I get over there? Ah, come on. Um, I don't think so. Alright. Let's check our journal. Okay, we just have to meet Regis at Mare La Chaise Longe Cemetery. We have a few secondary quests. Collect them all, yeah, yeah. Go to Corvo Bianco. So this is basically our home. I will actually, now that there is no time pressure on this quest, we can just chill out and do some side stories. And I wanna do, I wanna analyze my, my home area. I, I read we can upgrade this and stuff. So let's do that. So we are in vicinity to Beauclair, aren't we? Yep, this is the main castle. So let's go back to Corvo Bianco. But first we need to sleep. Uh, meditate, I guess, not sleep. <laughs> I wonder what these guys are thinking when I just run around uh, <laughs> chill all the way. These boats are not navigatable, aren't they? Okay, where do we have to go? In quite the other direction. Okay. Oh, can I get out of here? Oh no, doesn't look like it. Oh well. Shit, how do <laughs> I'm quite in a predicament really. Let's let's find a shoreline. We may have to go through the city. Oh my gosh, look at the architecture. The, I think I've unlocked another fast travel point. Come on. Oh there's there are no steps, it's only up to the waterfront. I need my horse. Where are you? Huh? Return to oh, nice. Of Rifia, perchance. Yes, indeed. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. <laughs> Look at the colors. Southern Italy, southern Spain. Was that truly necessary? And our knights, what are they? Chop <clears throat> liver? Keep calm! Start no brawls! Yeah, yeah, a witcher is necessary. Summoning a witcher? Was that truly ah. necessary? And our knights... What hey, you said that before. Never? Shut up. Hello, fellow. Well met. Ah, sir witcher. Okay. Wow, I, I'm sorry that I, I'm just hanging about here. But this is truly... Beautiful. I think this is the oh. most beautiful town I've ever seen. Oh. Sir, a cutscene. for you, sir. Letter? Who from? Can't rightly say, sir. I was just to deliver it. Here, and 
thanks. No, sir. Thank you. And I truly hope I'll be of service again. My dear okay, friend. what does this new letter say? I've been told you're on a jaunt to Tucson. I do hope you don't overtax yourself during the wine festival. The effects of such exertion at your age can indeed prove most detrimental. I've come upon some information which might be of interest to you. While browsing through a colleague's book collection, I found mention of one Professor Moreau of Beauclair, who conducted research into Witcher mutations. The details I've come to learn are rather vague, and his laboratory's location remains a mystery. Yet his journal should at least provide hints as to both. It is said he was laid to rest with it in his tomb. I enclose a map I found in the tome I happened upon. Though less than completely legible, I trust it will prove useful nonetheless. Should you grow tired of sampling Beauclair's ladies, wines, and other exquisite delicacies, this matter might prove a fruitful diversion. Investigate at your leisure. Your friend, Yennefer. Hmm. Professor who studied Witcher mutations. Might actually be worth looking into. By the horrid beast, kneels to the pay rack, pay rack, falls victim to his own cowardice. To send the beast to Beware of the beast. Interesting, this uh, Herald over there already has the news of the death of Maurice uh, Milton, I guess. And Yennefer came into play, interestingly. Um. I wonder if this is a quest for the new 4th level Witcher gear, or maybe some new Witcher armor, or maybe new potions, because they're talking about mutations. <gasps> oh no, 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 this is about the new feature, right. Okay, we'll look into that another time. For today, it's all you get from me. I thank you very much for watching, listening, and I will see you soon.